Hi everybody, Grandma Bev here from Life with Grandma Bev. And how are you doing on this glorious Saturday? Of course, it's hot out here. <laughs> I don't mean to make you feel bad. <laughs> well, today I'm going to do drawings for three videos. Now each one will have its own video. I mean, three giveaways. So this is for the giveaway. That's the inventory clearance, which is a big box of all kinds of stuff. So let's get started on that. I've got my <laughs> YouTube comment picker ready. I put the URL there and I want to filter the duplicate users. And include replies to comments. Filter the comments based on specific test text, which was Snowbird. S-N-O-W-B-I-R-D. Okay, and how many comments did we have? 59. So let's go over here. Push to start. Angie Anti-Love. Okay, Angie. Angie says, Hi, Grandma Bev. I hope you have a safe trip home, you snowbird. <laughs> so, Angie. Well, I mean, I, I know she subscribes, but let's... Let's go in and check uh, channels, channels, channels. If it looks like it's going to take too long, I'll put you on hold for a minute. But uh, you know, I think a lot of you don't uh, understand or, or realize what the definition of a snowbird is. I've come across that a lot during the week, and that's somebody who. When winter starts approaching or hit, hits, <laughs> they leave where they live, which could be like in a, a snowy state or wet state like ours, or, uh, somewhere up north, <laughs> in other words, generally. And they pack up and they move down to the south. Like you know, a lot of us go to Arizona, some go to Texas, some go to California. Those are the main states. Oh, and some on the east coast go, tend to go down towards Florida. So uh, they're referred to as snowbirds because of all the birds that head, you've heard the saying, the birds are heading south for the winter. So that's where snowbirds come from. And then on the opposite direction, if you lived like in Yuma here year round, where it can get up to 120 during the summer, and you, you want to flee the, the heat for, for the summer, you become a um, sunbird. <laughs> on a blank so that's what the definitions are in case you were wondering let's see come on looks like she's got a lot of people she follows did you all have a good st patrick's day oh we had you know a lot of people here well not a lot we there were 12 of us and bob cooked one of the corned beefs and another gal cooked an, uh, another one and everybody brought something so we had plenty to eat. And uh, if you want to see a little bit about it, I've got some things posted, of course. Look at videos from the last day or yesterday. Yesterday was Friday. I get so mixed up on the days. Well, looks like I'm going to be. Well, some of you who do watch my videos regularly, you know that I spent three days at the dentist this week. <laughs> Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and went through hell with root canal extractions. I'm feeling a lot better now, though. I'm just not eating on this side, which is where the extraction was. Mm. But it's nice to eat over here and not be in pain. But I'm, you know, I'm on antibiotics for it and this other little gel stuff that I put directly on where the tooth was pulled. It helps it the uh, skin and bone heal faster. Oh man, girl, how many people do you subscribe to? <laughs> I'm gonna put you on hold for a minute, be right back. Well, Angie, you're not subscribed to me. I went down through your list and it was a long one. Twice, second time even slower. And probably for some odd reason, YouTube's algorithm has removed you from my, my subscription list. So I'm gonna have to pick another person. I feel bad about that. I don't like having to do that. 
Let's see how I do this. I know she watches my videos because she'll make comments on them. Let's see. All right, go back up here and let's see. Come on, come on. Paste. <laughs> I'm gonna have to go back in. URL Pop link Okay, got it back pasted on there Filter duplicate include comments filter comments on the specific text text which was S N O W B I R D Snowbird should have the same amount of people. Yeah, 59. So let's go over here and hit the start. <laughs> this time it was Anne Marie Ramus. And I know she subscribes because she's a regular. She's always supported my channel since she got on there, and she's always making comments. So, you know, those people stick in your head. This one says, seems like the snowbird is heading home. Have a safe trip, and God bless you. Now, I'll go into her thing, just so that uh, nobody can say I didn't check. But I'm glad that I uh, <laughs> put you guys on hold while I kept looking for the other one. Because you would have been waiting quite a while. And you can see a lot of familiar faces pop up and go by. I always say I should start at the bottom because I always seem to be down towards the bottom of people's list, but I forgot. Familiar, boy. We must all we must follow the same people. Good singer. There's my daughter. <laughs> I saw a familiar face. Oh, my baby. I'm going to be seeing her in about two weeks. As we make our trek. Oh, here we are. Now, see if I can do this without making it. Uh, here we are. <laughs> the old couple. So, Anne Marie does not have her own channel. So, Anne-Marie, I need you to contact me uh, below in the, in the description area. I'm sure I have your address, but send me the email. Give me the address again, because <laughs> you know me. So, that'll do it. And I'm sorry that the other gal didn't wasn't on there, but I just don't know about YouTube and their algorithms. I mean, I went through a total standstill where everything dropped like 10 all of a sudden 10 people you know it just um that's weird it's also upsetting you know when you somebody thinks they won and and then they're not showing up on you know being subscribed to me so comments below share like subscribe and i hope you're all having a good weekend i love you all bye